Chicken. I've been seeing people having trouble with hunting down cougars due to uh, the Master Hunter Challenge number five, which is basically you have to hunt down two cougars, kill them with a knife only, and uh, take their pelts. So I'm going to make this little video really quick just to clarify a few things that could help you out. So here's Red Dead Redemption, how to hunt cougars. I'm going to give you a small taste and what to actually be prepared for once you actually start to go after these little bastards. As you can see right here, I actually just dropped down the bait so I could try to lure one in. And here I was trying to look around and boom, right on the face, he just comes out of nowhere. And that's what they call being ninja by a cougar. Just out of nowhere, they're very, very silent. Even right there when I had my knife ready and I was trying to look around with my camera, the little bastard gets in my defenses easily. But even if you see him coming and you have your knife ready, you take it on a cougar with a knife at full strength, uh, it's not going to work out. What are we going to do? I'm going to hand you over to him and watch him tear you limb from limb. What? I'm just kidding. We're going to run across the rooftops. The two most important things you're going to want to know right now is where to find the cougars and when. As you can see on the map right here, this area right here, right next to Gap Tooth Ridge, or in I should say, this is where I found my cougars. Now when, now I like Rockstar for doing this because it looks like they actually did their homework. Cougars uh, primarily only uh, prey uh, while it's dusk or dawn. That's what they do in real life, and it looks like it looks like that's what they did in this game. The things you will need with you when you do actually go after the cougars is first of all bait. You're going to be needing medicine because it, you're going to be very lucky if you do not get hit by those bastards, and they do hurt. They actually happen to be, in my opinion, one of the one of the worst enemies in the game. Uh, they are, in my opinion, more dangerous than the bears because the bears can kill you in two hits, but so can the cougar. But the cougars are freaking faster than God. So, bring medicine because you will be using it. You are also going to need a low power pistol to shoot the cougar in the hind legs. All right, let's put this plan into action. I waited around till dusk, as you can see. I am in the Gat Tooth area. And uh, right now I'm going to be putting down my bait. As soon as I do that, I'm going to be looking around because that little bastard's going to be coming. Let me see. So now where is he? Right? Uh, oh, shit, there he is. Oh, wow. He must have been uh, feeling sorry for me or something because he didn't attack me right away. See, what I did there is I shot him right in the hind leg and that reduces his speed immensely. Alright so let's go down the list. You have to be in the right area. You have to be in the right time which is dusk or dawn. You have to use the bait or else you're going to be waiting there possibly hours. You have to keep an eye on the area after you use the bait because he's going to be coming for you. Use the medicine if needed because that'll save your life and it'll save you a lot of grief. Uh, once you do see him, shoot the hind leg so he slows the freak down. Ch uh, once they slow down, chase them and knife them down. And don't forget to skin them because in order to get the actual, uh, gosh darn, what is it called? Uh, the, the challenge, you have to skin them, you have to get the pellet. So don't forget that or else it's just for naught. Hopefully this video helped out where some other ones did not. So hopefully it made, made it a little bit more clear. So, if you have any more questions or anything like that, go ahead and ask, and I will try to get back to you. Twice the mega power? What's mega power, and how could you have twice as much of it?